One day Elisa went to an aquarium planet. There she saw different kinds of fish. At one particular place she saw these small aquariums. Let us see how many fish are there in each aquarium. In each bowl there were seven fish. Cost of each bowl was 250 rupees. How many bowls are there? There were five bowls. Each bowl cost is 250 rupees. Let us calculate the total cost of the five bowls. 250 plus 250 plus 250 plus 250 plus 250. We need to add 250 these many times. We added 250 rupees five times. So in in short form we can multiply 250 by 5. This is easy. Okay. And this is also called as multiplication process. What is multiplication? Multiplication is also called as repeated addition. Let us do multiplications in this class. The symbol for multiplication is into. Here the number 250 is called multiplicand and 5 is called multiplier. The answer in the multiplication is called as product. You are all good at tables from 1 to 9. Let us start multiplications. Okay. See this example. 7, 9, 63. Uh, this uh, 7 and 9 we can call them as multiplicand and multiplier and these 7 and 9 also called as factors. The number 63 is called, the answer is called product. We know that we can change the order of the numbers while multiplying. So, if we change the order of the factors, we will get the same product. Let us see this example. Here, 2 into 4 into 5. We can multiply in any order. First, select 2 into 4 into 5. 2 fourths, 8 and into 5. So, 8 5 is how much? 40. Let us change the order of the factors. 2 into 4 into 5. We multiply 4 into 5. That is 20. 2 into 20. 2 20 is how much? 40. I change the order of the factors even though here the answers are same. See this example. First multiply 4 into 3. 4 3 is how much? 12. 12 into 5. That is equal to 60. Here, first I will multiply. To make a process easy, I will multiply 4 and 5. 4 5 is how much? 20. 20 into 3. 3 to 6 0. 60. In mathematical calculations, speed and accuracy are very very important nowadays. So, let us see few multiplication facts in this class. See this model. Double one factor and make half of another factor and multiply. The product obtained is equal to the product of the given numbers. Here 2 is there. Double 2. 2 plus 2 is 4. And write half of 8. Half of 8 is 4. Multiply 4 and 4. 4 fours how much? 16. Here 2 eights is also 16. So both answers are same. Let us see more facts about multiplication. Let us solve few multiplication sums in exercise 3a. See here, multiply and show the strategy. Take 2 and 50 into 7. 250 is how much? 50 plus 50 is 100. 250 is 100. Write 100 into 7. 100 7 700 or else write 717 
and two zeros. See this example. Here we will consider four and twenty-five first. Four into twenty-five into eleven. Four twenty-fives. Twenty-five plus twenty-five is fifty. In the same way, four twenty-fives. How much? Hundred. Write hundred into eleven. That is equal to eleven hundred. The next example, thirty-six into twenty-five. Here we can break up thirty-six as four into nine and twenty-five as this. Okay, four and twenty-five. First consider four into twenty-five into nine. Okay, four twenty-five is how much? Hundred. Into nine, hundred into nine is equal to nine hundred. Okay, one more example here. We will break up any number to use the strategy, which is possible. Twenty-four is possible. Okay. Four into six. I am writing four six twenty-four. No children. Four six twenty-four. So I here which number break up? Twenty-four. As four into six, now twenty-five. Write as it is. Okay. Now consider four and twenty-five. Four twenty-five is how much? Twenty-five plus twenty-five is fifty. Twenty-five plus twenty-five is fifty. Fifty plus fifty, hundred. So four twenty-five is hundred. Write it as four into twenty-five into six. This is hundred into six is equal to six hundred. Let us solve few sums mentally. See, here seven into forty. No need to arrange. You know uh, tables up to nine. Yes, you are good at uh, tables up to nine. Seven fours, twenty-eight. Write twenty-eight. And how many zeros are here? Write zero. Okay. Can you tell me six sixty is how much? Six six thirty-six and zero, three hundred. Sixty nine eights seventy two and zero seven hundred twenty eight sixties eight six forty eight forty eight and zero four hundred eighty. We can do multiplications with speed by using these tricks. Let us solve a few more examples mentally. See here, by using mind calculations, we can do these sums. Fourteen two is how much? Twenty-eight. Twenty-eight and zero is two hundred eighty. Okay. Let us see the next example. Twelve thirty is here. Here twelve three is how much? Thirty-six. Thirty-six and zero is three hundred sixty. See here eighteen forty is eighteen forty. So this is also we can do easily. Eighteen four is how much? Eighteen four. Eighteen four is seventy. Two and seventy-two and zero is seven hundred twenty. Now see here, sixteen threes, sixteen threes, forty-eight, forty-eight and zero is four hundred eighty. In this way, we can solve multiplications mentally.